Find insight, guidance, and answers. answers. Tune into Spirit with radio medium Laura Lee. Laura Lee. Laura Lee tuning into Spirit with my special guest caller, Dennis. Welcome. Thank you. Dennis, where are you calling from? Kentucky. Are you in a car or in a truck? Yeah, I'm a truck. Yeah, your mom's showing me. It's got to be your mom because she's like sitting right next to you in the truck. (laughs) Really? She always did love his truck. Did she? And in fact, she's saying Denny, not Dennis. Yep. Denny, my son. Yep. It hasn't even been a year. That's right. Yeah. Yeah, loves you so much. Wouldn't leave you. She shows me this image, Denny. I want to call you Denny. Okay. I'm assuming this is you, or unless it's another son. Wearing a baseball cap. At, we're at her burial and taking the hat off to pay respect to her. And alone there where her burial is. Do you understand what she's she's portraying no, to me? it wasn't me. I mean, it could have been somebody in a bag, but that wasn't me. Not during the ceremony, but alone. When you're alone. Oh. That's the key. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Was that you? Yeah. And she says she was right there with you at that moment. But the key that she wants to talk about is feeling alone. And she's telling me you've been having some hard night sleeping since she's transitioned, of course. That's a given. Absolutely. And then as a result, sometimes oversleeping in the morning and not getting to work or where you're supposed to be going the next day. Absolutely. And she says she's not the only one. She shows me also this other woman who's walked away. Then she shows me you trying to reach for her hand to pull her back. Does this make sense to you? I don't remember that, no. Okay, this is metaphorically. Another woman who's walking away and you reach for her to pull her back. Like there was some distance between you two and you feeling alone. And you pulled her back in. Unless this is a new love. Do you understand what she's saying here? Uh Yes. All right. And I feel like it's to keep a warm body there because she's telling me there's some other people who had been disapproving of this personal relationship. But I'm talking about a love relationship. Do you understand? Yeah. And this means friends as well as I'm assuming a sibling from what she's telling me. Okay. Does this make sense? Yes. And it might have caused a disagreement between you and some other people. Yeah, it has. Right. And she wants to ask you, are you happy? Yeah. Are you? Yes. That's all that matters, not what anybody else says. Okay. She wants you to know this because after you transition, that's the only thing that's most important is if you're happy and she so wants you to be happy. Oh, yes. (laughs) That's all that matters to her right now. And the next thing I see her doing is kissing the top of your head. And I don't know if this is something you guys would do to one another. Like she'd kiss you on top of the head or you would kiss her on top of the head. Does that make sense, Denny? Yeah. yeah. I mean, it was both. When I was sitting down, she would kiss me on the head. And then when I would leave because I'm taller, her, I would kiss her on the head. <laughs> Yeah. She told me that was key for me to convey to you as a confirmation to the message. So you knew it was coming from her. <laughs> okay. I appreciate it. Thank you for sharing your time with me today, Dennis. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Of course, it's always my pleasure. And if you'd like to call into the show, sign up at Radio Medium, com. And hey, if you haven't already, sign up and subscribe to our podcast and share it. We appreciate you.